I am starting from the grade 6 social study lecture number 4. From the chapter number 4 that is measuring of fat. In this chapter I will discuss different instruments that measure weather like rain gauge, wind valve, thermometer, barometer. Let's discuss each instrument of weather. A rain gauge measures the amount of rain that has fallen. Look at the picture. This is a metal or plastic container at the top of which is a funnel. Inside the container is a glass cylinder marked in millimeters. Rain falls on the funnel and collects in the cylinder where it is measured every day. Another instrument is thermometer. A thermometer is a tool that measures temperature. How hot or cool something is. Do you know thermometers are used to see if you have a fever or tell you how cold it is outside. The word thermometer means pretty straightforward. Thermometers measures temperature in degrees according to either the Celsius or Fahrenheit system. Do you know metrologists use thermometers to find out how hot it is or if it's below freezing? Doctors use thermometers to check your body temperature. A very high or low body temperature means you are sick. Here, I give a new two thermometer to the left side. This one thermometer we use for the body temperature and to the right side thermometer we use it for the environment temperature. Wind van. The simplest weather measuring device is the wind van. A metal arrow with a tail is mounted on a pole or roof so that it will turn around. It points in the direction from which the wind is blowing. Barometer. This measures the pressure or weight of the air and is probably the most important instrument for forecasting the weather. There are two kinds of barometers, the aneroid barometer and the mercury barometer. Let's discuss each barometer. The aneroid barometer. Look at the picture. This is aneroid barometer. It looks a bit like a clock. It can be carried about easily. It shows the weight of the air on a dial. So look at the dial. It shows the weight. Inside the case is a collapsible airtight box of thin metal with most of the air pumped out. As the air pressure changes, it pushes the sides of the box in or out and the end of the box has a string attached to it which works the dial. The mercury barometer, look at this picture. This is a glass tube about a meter long which is closed at one end. So look the picture. The top of this glass tube is closed. It is filled with mercury and the open end is placed in a bowl of mercury. This acts as a kind of scale. The vat of the air pushes the mercury up and down so that we can see how heavy the column of air above it is. The mercury barometer is fragile and cannot be moved easily. In the homework task, draw a diagram of the thermometer. Thanks.